Hello guys, welcome to Khan's Care Care, me with another tutorial after a long time. <coughs> Today in this tutorial we will be learning about making pendants and uh, making some money out of it. So we can use these pendants to sell them on Fiverr. We can make a gig on Fiverr and sell it on Fiverr. We can make a gig that's related to jewelry, art and design and we can make these pendants and sell them. So here's a very simple method today uh, that will help you to make pendants. Okay, so let's start with solid woods and uh, creating a new file. New part file. In this way you can create a lot of pe uh, pendants if you just have a sketch or the picture of that particular thing. And if you want custom made pendants, so you can also leave a comment in the section below. And uh, I can turn back to I can revert back to you uh, with the required pendant. So let's go to sketch tools. First, we initiate the sketch on the front plane. Then we go to tools. Oh, sorry, we go to tools, and then in the tools we go to sketch tools, and we go down, and we sketch picture. So let's look for some pictures here. Yeah, this is what I, what I got already. So let's start with this one. This is a simple uh, skull design, and we'll trace this thing for for a pen. This is just a simple, okay? This is just an example. So you can make anything out of it, okay? We will use this spline tool to trace this existing picture. Okay, and let's check it out. After you make the spline, you can adjust the spline from these control vertices. Adjust it as per your requirement. So this is this is the initial sketch we made now. Make this middle center line construction geometry and now mirror the spline. Okay, now we, we draw the inside. This is just a rough thing, you know, but you, you can you can you can do it as accurate as you want. Nice. Now let's do this one. Okay. So so far this is this is our sketch. Now let us see the vertices if there's any if there is any problem there. Okay, no problem at all. So now to make the pendant okay on the top we on the top you know we we must have some side of ring you know that will help to get the chain inside okay that will hold it okay so This is it. Now we use a simple extrude feature and you can extrude it to yeah, any dimension that you want. Okay, This is a very simple pendant. Okay, You can get the chain inside, you can wear it, you can do anything. Now but the other thing is sometimes we want some, some curvatures in these in these pendants. Okay, So you can do that with the flex command. You can go to tool, uh, insert, features, and there's the flex. Now, click on this. Okay, you can rotate these planes to, uh, wait a second. Yeah. 
Yeah, you can do it like this. Okay. And so uh, let's do it again. The rotation, yeah, this one, yeah, yeah. So, this is how you adjust these things. Mm -hmm. Okay, now you bend it, you can bend it at any point. Okay, you can. With the center, okay, yeah, like this. So it depends how you play with it, okay. So you don't need to worry about this thing. You can play in any sort of flex or power. Look, this is a curve now, so you can make it in any direction. Curve. This is just an example. So this is how you make pendants, and now you can sell these pendants, you know, and uh, you can you can scale it down to any dimension you want as per buyer requirements. So when you turn on, turn on the real view, you can see reflections and you can see how it works. Uh, so guys, I hope you like the tutorial and uh, you, when you make this kind of, these kind of uh, pendants, you just make a gig on your Fiverr account and uh, start from five bucks and uh, based on the, on the level of detail, you can, you can charge them as much as you want because this is this is a very good gig nowadays and you can earn a lot of money so i hope you guys, guys like the tutorial and uh, if you have any questions please leave it leave leave leave, the, leave your queries in the comment section i will entertain all your queries uh, so guys peace out